Hi, I'm back. How are you? I'm getting ready to do my makeup. Good morning. <laughs> so I'm going to be using my Level Up Cosmetics along with some other products today. And my Poshmark where I sell my Level Up Cosmetics is also linked below. And also this wig. Um, I wore it last night on my Shoe 7 channel. And I'll probably show you what it looks like after I do my makeup. So I'm going to be starting off. I already put primer on my face. And now I'm going to go into my Fenty. It looks all messy because I squirted it too much out and then put the top back on. But this is in the color um, 370 by Fenty. So let's slather it on, shall we? Hey. <laughs> put this makeup on. Fenty. Now, um, this one gives me a little bit um, more of a velvety finish. And then I also use this one sometimes for a more dewy, hydrated finish. It's the Fenty Beauty um, Hydrate, Hydrate or something like that, Pro Filter. So, but today I'm going to be using just the regular normal formula of Fenty. So I'm just patting it in. Hi. What browns am I going to use today? I'm going to be using, oh, what brows? <laughs> I don't know, whatever comes out. Maybe the Michael Jackson brow, baby. Hey, we'll see. <laughs> um, yes. <laughs> okay, so I'm just kind of patting it in. I like to pat it in because... Like if you drag it, you drag your skin. And then also it looks better when you pat it in. It looks more natural. Mm -hmm. You want to try the fancy girl? You should. It's good. It's I like it. I like I have like so many different foundations that I love, but this is one of the favorites. Okay. Different times of year I use different foundations depending on my skin. Fenty. All right. Now I gotta set it. I I usually if I want to like have a heavier makeup look, I'll put on a whole nother coat of foundation, or I'll spot uh, conceal with like the Fenty in the same shade. Like I have a little bit of blemishes um, around there. Probably just from sleeping with my hand on like this. <laughs> and then I'll just go and get under there. Fenty concealer is pretty good. It, it, it covers up really good. Um, and you can match the color. that They use the same colors as the foundation so you know which one is good for you. See, this is slightly lighter, just a tad bit lighter than the foundation. Um, but it's the same number so you know which one you should buy. So I like that. Um, let me just pat it in. See? Or you can get lighter if you don't want to blend it that close to the same tone. Okay. You said you're light skin, but your face is so much lighter. Almost. Get some bronzer. Just do your, um, put some bronzer on after, like the powder bronzer or liquid bronzer on your neck and stuff. <laughs> okay, there you go. Done with that. Now I'm gonna set it with some powder. I'm gonna set it with my Fenty powder. This is in honey. Honey. I got the whole. Fenty foundation routine going, don't I? <laughs> so, because it works so good. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get close up so y'all can see how it looks. Oh, I need to get in that right here. Sometimes I miss that um, crack in my nose. <laughs> All right, so I'm just going to use one of these little brushes to um, pat this Fenty in under my eye, set that concealer, and 
just pat it. Yep, you gotta set it with the powder. It'll stop all those fine lines. Mm -hmm. You see? Set that powder, girl. And then I go here to set here and look all up under here because this is where like you know where you sweat the most or where you touch the most or where you know it wrinkles the most so you just set it right there like kind of bake it and then you can just take a regular powder brush and just brush you know set the rest with just like a fluffy brush so that is this how i do it and then i just go down a little bit just so it can blend better And then I'll just wipe this away after baking it. I don't really bake too long because mm -hmm. this really there. So this is what I got. Now I have to do my contour. Thank you. I use Fenty. Who's Fenty? Yes. And then number 370. Okay, so I'm gonna be using my naked skin shape shifter. And y'all probably seen this before on this channel. It has the cream and then it has the powder. It's by Urban Decay. So that's the multitasker. Okay. So I kind of mix these two. And I go, whoo. Oh, you're new to this. Okay, well, fancy girl. You love my Michael Jackson hoodie? Yes. I get so many compliments on this hoodie. I think I ordered it on Amazon or one of those places. I just typed in Michael Jackson hoodie. <laughs> on the search on Google, and a bunch of them popped up, and I bought a couple of them. <laughs> Might get some more. And Sasha has a few. I don't think Layla wants one. She has a t-shirt. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I kind of just go around and kind of sculpt my face and how I want it to look. You know, give it some shadow and some... I'm going to go under here with the darker color. Okay. Just thins out your face a little bit, you know. Don't wear white. <laughs> okay, so I'll just kind of blend it in. You can do your nose too. I'm gonna do my nose real quick. I do like a slanted brush. And if y'all don't have brushes, y'all can order my Level Up cosmetic brushes. It says Level Up Cosmetics on it. On my Poshmark, on the hit the link below. And it gives you 15 brushes. So if you're a beginner, you're just, you know, starting out, you don't know what makeup brushes to buy. Here you have a pack of 15 brushes for like most of the things you'll need it for. Okay, hi. <laughs> so I just go up and down like that with the nose contour and then I'll just blend it out. Um, Yes, I just blend it out like that with like a little foundation brush. How much? I don't even remember. Let me look it up. <laughs> look, I don't have my own price. It is. So here's what my Poshmark looks like, you guys. <laughs> here's all the things you can buy. There's a whole kit. It comes with a set of the sprinkle sprinkle brushes, which are like glitter brushes. The I bring nothing to the table palette highlighter lashes um, lash glue and lip uh, liquid lipstick um, then I have the lip plumper and the little cosmetic bag my keychains my um, gypsy glamour eyeshadow palette eyebrow lipsticks magnetic lashes those these are what I wear um, for the last couple of weeks my highlighter and then these brushes right here they are 
How much did I press them for? $23, but they're very nice quality. They're wooden handles with the gold hardware. Uh, vegan, and it's, um, here, I have some right here. So y'all can see the quality and the handle. It's really pretty. It's a baby pink. It comes with like a flat foundation brush. Um, this is not supposed to be a promo, but I'll just show you the whole thing. I've been using some, so they uh, they have all the eyeshadow brushes and um, slanted brushes and foundation brushes. So yeah, they come with the little plastic coverings on them as well to keep them, like if you want to carry them out with you. So it's a good deal. <laughs> but for wooden vegan brushes, it's a really good deal. Then I also have all my lipsticks and eyeshadow and liquid liner and mascara. So y'all can go and check out my Poshmark. Thank you. Uh huh. Uh mm huh. -hmm. Okay. Yeah, and the um, the liquid, I mean the eyebrows is the my eyebrow pencil is the Level Up eyebrow pencil, and it has a spoolie at the end. It also has a top, but I lost it. And they come in different colors, and they're waterproof, so they'll stay on pretty much all day. I'm gonna be using this now. This is in the color number three. I'm gonna just brush my eyebrows up. I'm gonna draw these Michael Jackson brows now. Okay. I need a mirror. Maybe I'll get my little mirror. So, this is cute. So I need to do this contour. Yeah, the contour. And then when you do your blush, it blends out even more. And then I put my highlighter on top when I'm done. So what I do with my brows, if y'all are new, y'all don't know, I just outline them. From the top and the bottom so I can get the shape. And then I see where it arches and then I can just draw it over like that. And then down like so. See, all you gotta do is outline. Is that Michael Jackson brow? Is that good enough? We'll see. Is that Michael Jackson only enough? Now, if you want to be real particular, you can like do hair like strokes in the same direction as your hairs. This takes a little bit longer, but it looks more natural and defined. See? Then you get up in here. Remember, go to the same direction as your hair. You take the spoolie and then you just brush it and that makes it even more hair-like. See? Bam! Natural brown. Let me finish it over here. Um, let's see. Hmm. Done, you see? Got an eyebrow now. I just plucked, so they kind of look a little bald for real. But uh, if you want it to go more in, then Draw the line out a little bit further, like so. It has to be on the same angle though, like that. And if you don't want like a harsh brow, sorry, I didn't mean to flip y'all off. Um, if you want a more natural, just draw the bottom line and draw the top line and then brush up and it'll blend it very naturally to look like real hair. Don't see? I drew some weave on my eyebrow. <laughs> okay, got that. Now, if I if I do a very, you know, harsh makeup look, I'll have to darken my brows. But if I'm gonna go light, then I'll just keep something like this. 
um, as a brow. So sometimes my makeup is too bold and then my eyes, eyebrows kind of disappear if I don't do them a little bit bolder. So but this is a natural brow look today. See? I got to do the other one. But okay, I'll do the other one. Got to brush it up. It's important you brush them brow so you know what direction to draw. <laughs> Okay, so then I just outline again. And I just follow my natural arch that I plucked. <laughs> okay. And just go down a little bit like that. Stay with the right angle. Kind of where they meet, that's where it ends. Where they meet, that's where it ends. <laughs> and then I take this one and then I go right over so to, just to make sure they match and they hit the same place. I go like this. You know, this is how they do in art class. This is how they teach you to do it in art. You're drawing a face. Line it up with the angles. Okay, so now I'm just going to. Slowly go in the same direction. I kind of like doing eyebrows because it's like the most challenging part of the whole face and makeup routine. So I enjoy it. It's like, how good can I do them today? And sometimes they be off, but hey, at least I try. Sometimes they're off, but then I can fix them. I'm going to clean them up too, just a little bit. So this is a little darker, but um, I'm going to brush this out. Mm -hmm. see, I've got some eyebrows now. So uh, this is a little bit thicker than this side. You know, which side do you like better, the thicker side or the thinner side? Thicker thin. <laughs> i got to even them up. Thin? Okay, I do too. Mm -hmm. So this, I'll show y'all how to fix it if y'all do it too thick, like I just did. I always fix it, because I always do that. <laughs> All right, let me teach y'all how to fix it if you do it too thick. And also make them look cleaner. Um, so you take like a slanted brush. Um, I have one in my, my kit. And... Um, like that, a slanted brush. And I have an old one I'm just gonna use because it's already dirty. And just go into like some foundation. I'm going into eye primer that's foundation colored. Just kill two birds with one stone. And so I just clean it up. I just go under it like this. It's kind of like an eraser. And you just go slowly. You can use uh, concealer for this or foundation too. Um, and you just go slowly. Get that arch like that. Clean it up. You can also do it from the top. And I just I just put it like right here and just glide it over because <laughs> it kind of just erases anything that did not go correctly or that came out of line and then you can like reshape them and thin them out like that too so you like the thick sometimes i'll do the thick but today this is thick enough i think thick looks good when you do minimum eye makeup so if you're not going to do a lot of eyeshadow and liner and stuff thick is thick is good because it draws the attention to the eye um, especially if you're not putting on a bunch of makeup. Okay, so now I have to get this angle and this angle the same. So I kind of just play with it. Kind of go like here and I try to measure. Is there any sticking out above that? Yes, I erase it like that. See, now it's close to the same. Um, 
it's also the same thickness. And that's it. I'm gonna just go back in and fill it in. So, ta -da! See how it's kind of sparse right there? So I'm just gonna go dot it up. I'm gonna hit this little tail a little bit to darken it back up. And that's it for that eye. I'm gonna brush it a little bit more. All right, so now I gotta clean up the other eye underneath just to match. You do them rounder? Yeah, y'all know I gotta represent Mike. <laughs> He's my eyebrow inspiration when I draw them. <laughs> Didn't he have good brows though? Uh -huh. The bad eye, no, the dangerous eyebrow. I have this tattoo with the eye. Okay. So it's a little bit sharp right there. I need to make the other side sharper. Just a little bit. You can always draw it back down if it's too sharp. So I'm just putting my primer on for my eye shadow anyway. Mm, I might, I don't need it this sharp. I'm just gonna round it out a little bit. Okay, good enough. Um, I mean this one too. Brows take a little while, like especially if you want, are trying to get them to look perfect, which they never do, but. It'll take a little while, but they're worth it. All right, so what are y'all doing getting into this weekend? Y'all have any plans? Y'all going out? Going, I don't know if it's cold, rain, or wherever where y'all are at. The weather's just everywhere. Going nuts. All right, so this is going to be. Now, when I want my thick brow, I go into my Kat Von D uh, Super Brow and Walnut. So, <gasps> my nail chipped. Oh, I have to go get my nails redone. Yeah, about that time. I just did that too, because that wasn't like that. It's raining where you are. You're in Russia. <laughs> cool. All right, so, done with the brow. Plus, you know, I can fix them if they need to be fixed later. So, I hate when I drop stuff. Now let's get into these eyebrows. Where are my brows? I mean, eyeshadow. Oh, there's no shadow. Okay. I'm going to be using my Level Up Cosmetic Pinup Nudes. Instead of calling this palette Pinup Nudes. They're browns, nudes, and little sparkly colors, but they're still browns and nudes. I'm just going to hit my whole eye. Let's see. I'm going to use one of my new brushes. I have them. Let me just bring them over here. It's like they keep getting them. Okay, so. I'm just going to hit my whole eye with this color right here. It's like a natural color. It snowed where you are. Oh my goodness. In North Carolina. Okay. Yeah, yes. Okay. Get that coat on. Now I gotta do the transition color. I'm gonna use this brown for the transition color. Like a darker tan. And just hit that. See. All the brushes that you need are in this set. So you just hit that in the crease with this brown here. You see you already have some definition to your eye. Sometimes I go all the way up with the brown and kind of blend it into my contour. Okay, now 
I know y'all are saying, what? <laughs> y'all. All right. So then I'm going to take this pencil brush and um, I think there's a similar one in the kit that I have, but I have spread them all out all over the place. But anyway, this is like a cheap one from Dollar Tree or whatever. So I'm just going into this deeper brown. It has a little bit of sparkle in it, but not a lot. And it's matte. So it's not going to be like all extra sparkly. Let me get my small mirror. But just hit this crease. If you don't have a crease, then you can just, you know, hit, you know, do a smoke eye or whatever. Or just blend it out if you have a different type of eye shape. I mean, y'all know what's best for your individual eye. And I'm going to blend that, but let me do the other side first. In this color. Uh huh. Mm hmm so anyway uh, let's see just going to take this just in like just the natural shape of my crease we went overboard on this side so I'm gonna make up for it over here a little bit extra. Okay, now I'm going to blend it out with that same brush I did the transition color with. Just a little bit. See, it's that simple. Hi. Hey, Mama D, you on here? Okay. It's Mother No Shade. <laughs> Shout out to Mom D. I'm doing my makeup. How you doing? Good morning. <laughs> Rise and shine. You changed your show title? Oh. Change is good. I'm just blending this out a little bit. All right. Now I gotta do my highlight color under there, brow, under that brow bone. Okay. I'm gonna use this brush, it's like a little flat eyebrow brush. I'm gonna go in, so, you know, you can go in for like a sparkly color or like, you know, a brighter color. If you wanna shimmer shine, they have these. Um, I'm gonna go in for this matte and just hit this brow bone. I might go over it with some sparkly color. But I like to get this on first just to get that highlight going underneath it at least. <laughs> if y'all want to join the group, um, I have, yeah, you hit, hit up Mama D. She can get you in. Or what? what's your name on here? It's Mother No Shade. Yes. Okay, so got that. Now, I clean up the, the edges. Um, you clean up the edges with like a makeup wipe or foundation or whatever. If you just don't want them hanging down like, like that, you can do that. Clean up the edges and then get you. Okay. Thank you. I just kind of pat it right here in the corner. Hello. I don't even have that service. Mm -hmm. So I'm just like that. Robo calls, don't you little? All right. So then, if you want a bigger looking eye, you can line your bottom line with like a nude or a white color eyeliner. I'm, I'm going to use this one. Um, it's by, I don't know. What brand is this? Ruby Kisses or something like that. Uh, I got it from the beauty supply store. But if you want your eye to look wider, you just hit that water line. You see? And makes it look wider. I got it on my lash. 
But you need the mirror first. I'm gonna hit this. I'm gonna concentrate instead of looking at the camera. If you have small eyes, it's all look like you're awake. <laughs> all right, so now I'm going to blend this a little bit more with that highlight color. Just barely. All right, there we go. Now I want some liner. I'm gonna be using my level of cosmetic. Well, actually this is Sasha's now because she uses this more than I do, <laughs> but I will be using it today. Okay, so now we can, we're gonna do a cat eye. And the angle is very important, so. You draw a line, then I draw another line at an angle, and then I fill it in. It's easy to do if you just do it in separate parts and strokes and don't try to rush it. Just lay it down. Lay it down, lay it down. Uh -huh. Just, this is waterproof, by the way, so it'll stay on. So you can make it longer if you want. Thank you for showing us who up without moms how to do our makeup. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay, so again, make sure the angles are kind of similar. They're not going to be perfect, but it's close enough, you know. So now I'm gonna just dot it, and I'm gonna put lashes on so it won't even look this thick after I get the lashes on. So, because it will kind of hide some of this anyway. And help the lashes blend in better. Or just do a lot of mascara on hand. Mm. Let's see. Do, do, do. Y'all, there's people that wake up looking for me. I promise you. I, <laughs> they wake up with me on a schedule. Just waiting for that employment call. Hope I get the job. So they be waiting on a um, parole officer to call. <laughs> I'm talking about some of the trolls. You know, I, 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 I'm happy that you guys love, you know, wake up <clears throat> and, you know, maybe get the alerts. But the trolls get the alerts too. Now you know that's love. Okay. How you gonna have? How you gonna have uh, an alert for whoever goes live if you're a troll? That's that makes me. I'm proud of myself. Mm -hmm. It's like paying 
or a front row seat to the concert of a megastar so you can throw shade. Thank you. <laughs> Wearing ankle monitors, right? They can't leave the house. Okay, so now I'm getting ready to let me make sure these match up good enough. Um, I think this one is, needs to go a little bit longer. Wearing ankle monitors. Mm hmm. I'm talking about the haters that keep changing screen names. You really got 20 passwords trying to get to me. 20 Google accounts trying to find me. Ooh. If they only had money and was actually a man, James would have some competition. <laughs> so I know most of them are women with men names. Anyway. Ooh, I'm dangerous. I'm gonna get these lashes on. So I'm gonna be using my Level Up Cosmetics magnetic lashes, you guys. And they come with the little tweezer thing, lashes, and then the liner, magnetic liner. So y'all can get these on my Poshmark too. These are the number four. Oh, yeah, that's the number four. I have two choices on there. I have more options, but I'm, I'm going to release them later. So that's what those look like. And y'all can see how they're magnetic. And they stick to the little magnet thing. Y'all can see the magnets on them. I don't know if you can see if y'all can see it. See the little magnets on them? Okay, so just take the little magnet. Um... Liner, this is like black liquid liner that has magnetic stuff in it. And you just draw it over your liner already, or if you don't have liner, this can be your liner. So it looks like that. And I put it all when it's still wet. That way it, st it sticks a lot better. So you just, just kind of kind of paint where you want your lashes to lay. And I kind of do a little bit on my lash as well, just in case it kind of scoots down or scoots up. I'm going to go all the way to where I know the lash is going to lay. I'm going to just take the lash and just lay it down. Like I forgot to put mascara on, but that's okay. Uh, I think it's easier to apply the lashes if you don't put the mascara on because that makes it curl up a little bit and so they don't lay right. So you can if you want, if it's if you have like really straight lashes, mine curl. So I have to do it after or not at all. So there, I just laid it on. And then I'm just gonna clean up the liner that kind of kind of got out of line with a makeup brush. I mean with a makeup wipe. And then you can go back in with your level up liner and see they're gonna they're gonna um you can hold it right here so that the magnet can touch and then there we go you're on <sighs> uh-huh anyway haters on the front line no haters no boppers haters on the front line what that? hey All right, next. Oh, all right, I forgot to redo this. <laughs> okay, so make sure that's in play. Now this is, um, this one that I'm holding is waterproof, so you have to work fast before it dries. I'm just dotting it where it got a little bit messed up. That's all. It doesn't look good. All right. And that's it. Next eyebrow. Get this and paint it on. You said dudes secretly want to know how to do makeup. Oh, they do. They want to see how we transform ourselves. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's all art. We are artistic beings. Let's use our creative side of the brain. Oh, right side of the brain for that. All right, I'm just gonna lay it down. Wait. And this nail broke too. That was a piece of damn. I don't know what color I should get next. The red is really pretty. I got that for Valentine's, but Okay, y'all. The lash is done. All right. So, ooh. My bad. See, it looks less, the liner looks less thick once you get the lashes on. It's still thick, but it doesn't look as dramatic as it did without the lashes. On. So, I'll do it a little bit thicker. All right, now for some blush and some lips, y'all. And some highlighter. Okay, so I'm going to use, because I'm doing browns, I'm going to use my Clinique Fig, um, Fig Pop number 10. That's what it's called. I need to get a new one because I dropped it and it kind of broke. Okay, so I'm just going to go in. You, you missed my contact lenses? Oh, really? Yeah, contact lenses, makeup, and lashes. Girl, my eyes be hurting. <laughs> All right. So I'm just gonna blend that in. This is a really pretty orangey, pinkish coral color. That looks good on. You can build it or get it lighter. But I just like, I just like that color. All right, now I usually go in with like a powder brush and kind of go over it so it's not too dramatic and then I blend it with my contour in the bottom. Now I need my highlight, so get my fan brush from my, my makeup brush set and then I'm gonna go and use my Level Up Cosmetics um, Bahamian Goddess highlight. This could be bronzer or highlight, depending on your skin tone. It's a highlighter on me. See? It just gives a really pretty natural glow. Just right where the light hits. See? And it's not so bright. It's not overpowering. It just gives your skin a very healthy look. Y'all go get this. Y'all, this is my favorite. Look at that. I'll go get that. Yeah, I'll go cop that. You'll be glad you did. All right. And then I'm going to just gonna take um, a fluffy brush with the, and just kind of blend it so that there's no light, like lines or whatever. So it looks like your real skin. <laughs> Y'all, what's your skincare found? What's your skincare routine? I like. See? And it also makes you look younger because you have that youthful glow and it doesn't look like glittery or it doesn't look like a bunch of glitter or you know bright highlight. It just looks natural. See? So that's your look. Now for lipstick. I don't know what lipstick to wear. I'm thinking red. I've been doing a lot of red lately. Thank you, beloved Bliss. Shira, aka Big Sister. I want to just say thank you for all, for the inspiration. Of always buying the products. Oh, you're buying the products today. Thank you. I appreciate it. It'll probably be sent out on Monday because y'all know um, I have to do it, package it up, and all that kind of stuff. Write y'all a little personal uh, thank you and all that kind of good stuff. So and it should go out Monday if you order today. Thank you. Your whole look is amazing. I'm like, thank you. So red lips, pink lips, nude lips, what I'll let y'all decide today. Y'all tell me, y'all see what I got on. I got on a very colorful shirt. <laughs> y'all tell me what y'all want me to do. So, 
pink, black, red, nude, y'all. So this is the pink I would be using, which is my Charmer Level Up Cosmetics Lipstick. Mm hmm You love the red lips. Mm. This is the nude that I'll be wearing. It's like a brownish nude. I might do a gloss over it. And this would be the red that I would wear. You can all get these on my posh. Mm. Red, 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 baby pink. Mm -mm. It, it really wouldn't go with this look. The pink, I don't know. I can try it. Let's see. This is more of a natural pink. It's matte. And it's... Red. This is my Michael Jackson uh, hoodie. It's the Dangerous album cover. Yes, that's Bubbles. Bubbles! Mon the Monkey King, Bubbles, Sun Wong Kong, whatever y'all want to call them. Okay. He said, yes, maybe red. Yeah, because see, this eyeshadow would go better with red. This is. I mean, it looks good with the pink too if I had done like a pink blush <laughs> and maybe less of the brownish color. You know, if I'd just done a darker brown. Mm hmm. I'm gonna go for the red. Mm hmm. Um, I don't really use liner, it takes too long. But it, I used to. I used to use liner a lot until I kept kept losing the liners or they kept breaking and I now have a sharpener or they, they break or I just, if I use a liner, I try to do like a liquid lipstick as a liner instead of a liner because like I have liners. But look, now I gotta go look for a sharpener and I don't have one because I don't know where it's at. So I should be using it for my pencils. So I'll like use a lip liner with this, and then I'll buy an expensive liner like this, and then it'll break and be worthless. So I just don't even use liners anymore. <laughs> They're just not for me. They always break, get lost. I can't find a sharpener to them. <laughs> so I just like forget it. Forget it. I can't do this no more. It's stressing me out. See? I don't know. They just fall out or break. So I don't bother anymore. But what I can do is use a liquid liner. But see, with some of these lipsticks, I don't even need to. Like, I don't even need to use liner with this. Unless you want, like, the color contrast, like the ombre. Then, yeah. I just go straight on the line like that. Like that, see? Uh huh. That liner, girl. I don't even bother with that liner anymore. I'm like, y'all just against me. Liners are against me. So, if I need to make it look real crisp, I'll just go over, you know, do the bottom with the foundation and clean up the lips, lips, and then, or I'll use a liquid lipstick to do the liner. Because it's not. It's going to be there when I need it. <laughs> and I'll just get in the corners like this.
Mm -hmm. There we go. Now, if I wanted to overdraw them, yeah, I'd have to use some type of liner or liquid lip. But I'm gonna just clean it up. Oops. <clears throat> um, one thing. Red looks like Ursula. Thank you, girl. I like Ursula. <laughs> now for this hair. Oh, I forgot to spray. Oh, hold on. Let me blend. Let me blend a little bit here because this line is a little harsh. I'm just gonna blend that contour. I forgot to do mascara on my bottom lashes, so let me go ahead and hit the bottom lashes. This is my Too Faced Christmas mascara that came in one of my little Christmas kits. And so I'm just gonna hit them lashes. Uh oh. Oops, slip my eyeliner. Now I got the Michael Jackson eyes. Oh. Tell me. I'm dangerous. Let me do a little curl. <laughs> Michael was my inspo today. All right. Do a little curl. <laughs> so this wig, I have it linked below. This is my new wig from Y Wigs. It's um loose wavy. I wore it on my video. Why we used last night on She Was Seven um, channel, and so so it's under a hundred dollars, and you can probably even save even more if you use my coupon code below. If you were looking for a hundred percent human hair wig, you know you can wet this, put product in it. There's you can part it all over the top, and this is the uh, loose wave Peruvian. Uh, and it's a 360 wig as well. It has like the invisible lace. I cut the lace off. It comes with baby hairs. You can cut them shorter if you like. Or pull them off. It doesn't matter. But under $100 right now. And probably be cheaper as well. Using that discount code. So this is the final look. And I don't know. I had it parted on the other side. But it looks a little strange. Or just hadn't. She's used to this. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, so I'm going to fluff it out a little bit because I want it to look a little thicker. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Cute hood. Yes. So it's, it's, cold. it's like 30 something degrees in Houston. I don't know if it warmed up yet. But it was earlier. So I was trying to stay warm. I still got this big old hoodie on. I've been wearing hoodies for the last couple of days because it's been cold. So where is my water bottle? Okay. I'm gonna spray it myself in my face. The thing is all waterproof. <laughs> my eye makeup, anyway. Okay. Ta da! I didn't glue it down because y'all don't know, like to glue it. But you could if you wanted to. And that's it. It's 24 in D Detroit. Is that hot or cold for that this time of year? I don't know. Um, yeah. So that's the look I need to spray and set my face. If I can find my setting spray. This must be it. Yeah, like a Morphe setting spray. It's like a mist. It smells good too. And
I'm going to work some more with this hair, but this is basically what I'm going to be looking like today. So what do y'all think? I'm going to take a selfie. I want to take a selfie with me. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Ooh. Take a selfie of y'all. Don't feel me, y'all, on my computer, y'all. So. I'm going to take a selfie of myself. <laughs> but I have to put a filter on. I don't know. People are so addicted to filters. That was my pose. What y'all think? <laughs> Less obvious? Okay. There we go. There we go. That's good. All right. Oh, thank you. Y'all like this hair? It's in the link with the, with the uh, coupon code. Hey. Under a hundred dollars, y'all look for y'all first human hair wig for under a hundred. This one should be it. Y'all go get it. Y'all go cop it. Put my discount code in, and it'll be way less than a hundred. Selfie, selfie, yes. Okay. <sighs> okay. Thank you. Where I get my case? Y'all know where I got that case back. Okay. Louis Vuitton, baby. <laughs> sprinkle, sprinkle. How many inches? I think it comes in different lengths, but I think this one is probably 20. To, yeah, I think this one's 20. It comes down to what, this long. So it could be 20 or longer. It's not very, it's not super long. So it's like, mm hmm I did my waterline. I sure did. My eyes look bigger. Mm -hmm. Um, thank you. So I guess I'll go prepare to go on my other channels and talk to you guys over there and get started with the day. Get my coffee. Well, I have my coffee. I started drinking. Oh, by the way, if you plan on buying that lipstick, that red lipstick I just used, and it's sold out, the next best color, uh, because it, it, there's only a few left, the next best color to get is She Red, I think. Yeah, it's it's in the uh, pink. And I also have a natural pink in that as well. But I don't have it with me. It's not up here because I have it in my purse or something. But the next, rest, the next best color is the She Red, if that one is sold out. Okay, or if you like the darker red, then get the Rake, call the Rake. So, um, yeah. Just so y'all know, we be sold out like, very soon, because it's a popular color, but I, I'm gonna try to get some more back in stock as soon as I can. Y'all know, um, I didn't know it was gonna sell out that quickly. Thank you. It's not sold out yet. She read it sold out. <sighs> well, the next best color is my liquid. It's liquid. It's a liquid. It's not this color, but it's, it comes in a liquid one like this. The next best one is, uh, I think, number eight in the liquid lip colors. No, it's waterproof matte liquid lip colors, and it's a similar color. <laughs> bright red <laughs> keep dropping stuff um but um siren this is siren this is the color siren siren is probably still for sale there's my there might be a few left what color i got on my waterline girl girl i just used this nudish color it has like a Tad bit of sparkle. It's by it's called Lux, Luxurious Eye Liner Eye Drama by um, 
Mm -hmm. I don't know the name of it. It's like really small. I got it from the beauty supply shop. FC. I'll just show you what it looks like. I got it at the beauty supply store. So it's just like one of those little cheap new liners that you get there. This is like the name of it, but I can't see it. It's like an F and a C on it. But I'm, you can just use any one. I have a white one too. You know, the white. I use like a creamish, sparkly one. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Skincare routine is my level up highlighter, actually. And I just wash my face and moisturize and exfoliate like maybe once or twice a week. Um, and then I use like I've been lately I've been using this old school Pond's moisturizer for moisturizer. And then I just use um, you know, whatever cleanser I have on hand or makeup wipes, and then I use like um the the uh, Pond's cold cream, and then I just get all the makeup off with it. I, mean, I went old school, I went back to the old school and my skin got really moisturized. So, <clears throat> and, and the products are so much cheaper. <clears throat> I was spending like, so much money on moisturizer and ponds. This is just good. I'm like, what the heck about? I, you know, so that's what I've been doing. But um, before that, and sometimes I still do use this belief um, moisturizer. Got it at Sephora. It's white. This is really good too, but the Pond's actually works better on my skin. Uh, <clears throat> You're welcome. It's super cheap. I, I was impressed. Like I saw somebody using it on, on YouTube and I was like, let me go try it. Plus I wanted to do a vintage video and like vintage products. And let me try that. And I stuck with it because it works. I was like, let me keep it. Oh, did I show you all my donuts? Did I already show you all my donuts? And I did not show you all my donuts on this channel. Oh my gosh. It's makeup. This is by, it's called Donut Tray Palette Donut by I Love Revolution. And aren't these cute? And they're squishy on the top. So there's highlighter and blush. And I have eyeshadow palettes. And let's see what that is. Aren't these cute? This is highlighter. It's not very sparkly, but I can make it work. Um, then, look at this one. She went. This one is bronzer or contour. That's cute. I have another one. It's like jelly. And it's, um, this is called peanut butter and jelly. It even smells good. Like, it's, it's scented. And then they give you like a box of um, sponges, like a bunch of them in a circle. You get like a bunch of makeup sponges in there. Um, yeah. Cute, right? <laughs> I know donuts are everywhere. <laughs> I got this on Amazon, this hoodie. I just ordered it online. Uh, just type in Michael Jackson hoodie. See what pop up, or this will pop up. A bunch of different ones will pop up, but just buy them all and represent, okay? <laughs> I mean, you know I'm gonna get some more. I have this I have this in a fitted shirt, a fitted long sleeve shirt that I actually bought from um, Las Vegas at the Michael Jackson store for their, um, you know, Michael Jackson one to, um, Cirque du Soleil thing. And I also have the ja a jacket 
Really? I got a whole Michael Jackson collection. I got Michael Jackson purse. I have Michael Jackson socks. People always buy me Michael Jackson stuff. That's like everything. I keep it in my closet. Because he's the closet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> kind of darkening them up a little bit. <laughs> So, I'm just going to make sure they're moving. You know, I want to put that hair on, kind of swipe some of that away. Uh, well, maybe it did. Maybe I'm just being picky. I'm being picky. All right. I just made it a little darker so it wouldn't be so light. All right. Waterline is just some cheap color from the Dollar. I mean, from the beauty supply shop. I don't know. It's just this from the beauty supply shop. Let's, let me see what it says Pink Pearl by. This is the color Pink Pearl, and the name of the company is, see if I can see it because I'm blind, FC Forever Cosmetics, I think, I can't read it, something cosmetics, FC, just put in FC. This is what the logo looks like. If y'all can read that. It's too small for me to read. I'd have to take a picture and zoom it in because I'm blind. Let's see if I can zoom it. I can do that. This is how old people do that have you know modern technology. You like take a photo and then zoom in instead of using like you know those purse magnifying glasses that old people use or the purse magnifying cards. You just take a picture and be like, I can't see it. Okay, I can zoom in and show y'all. Still can't see it, darn it. It's like, Fem, okay, Fem. Fem, F-E-M-M-E. Femme Couture. There you go. I was saying Forever Cosmetics. Y'all know I'm blast. Okay. What kind of lashes are these? Well, these are a level up cosmetic lashes, darling. And they're magnetic. And you can get them on my Poshmark, which is listed below in the description bar. Um, they come with a little liquid liner um, magnetic thing and then these are magnets so your lashes will stick to them and it also comes with a little applicator that you put the lashes on with and they fill out yeah and it comes in this cute little box and this is these are number four so uh there's two two choices there's number six and number four these are the number four number six is probably more natural i think okay Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm getting ready to go to my other channels, so I'll see y'all over there very soon. Okay, I gotta go upstairs and you know set up, and then I'll be on in a, probably about five five minutes, five or minute, five minutes, or maybe just a tad bit longer, but definitely in the next ten minutes. I'm go. Okay. So I'll see y'all on the other channel. Um, subscribe. He like as you go out, you know, and I'll see y'all later. Bye. Why don't I have a job? Who said that? <laughs> Are you quoting? <laughs> you said, why don't I have a job? Is that a serious question? What should my answer be? Oh, okay. Uh, I was at a child support hearing and the hostile hearing officer asked me that. <laughs> Darn it. 
Oh, what would you, what would I have said? I would have pulled the race card, of course. Just to see that face. I don't know. Anyway. Still sound dusty. Uh -huh. Anyway, you said you was hot. I'm looking for a job. I'm looking for a job and start crying. I'm looking for a job every day. It's just so scary. They said I need a master's degree. So I'm trying to go back to school. Just make up a whole sad sob story. I'm trying to go back to school. And daycare costs more than I would actually earn at the other all the other types of jobs, and so it would make sense for me to work. Girl, break the math down. I mean, he's not paying me the correct amount of child support or giving me anything, so I can't even afford daycare to go look for a job. It makes sense. Why don't you have a job, sir? I mean, why don't you have a real job? <laughs> right. You say the same thing? Monkey King? Yeah. It's Michael Jackson. All right, it's Bubbles too. I'll see you on another channel.